Hello, I'm Dave Milhouse, and this is the most important thing I know. Let's get into it. You can find me right here on the Twitter. Hit me up there. YouTube, I'm just breaking into. Twitter is where I do most of my work. Let's get into this. This is the most important thing that I've learned, I think, in my whole life. I'm going to show you exactly what I'm talking about. We're going to talk about compound interest. I'm going to lay this out very simply so that anyone can understand how important this actually is. I'm going to give you a time frame of 55 years. We'll put, let's just say, 2000 bucks principal. A 15% annual rate return. That's my goal in the stock market. Um, look, most people average less, okay? Uh, a lot less, but I'd like to think I'm above average. So I want to beat the market. If you get 8% per year, which is about the market average, the S&P 500, in 55 years with a 200, or I mean with a $2,000 down, you're gonna turn that $2,000 into $160,000. Now why 55 years, why is this important? Because your money is compounding, the longer it's in the market, obviously the more money you're gonna make. If you open up an RSP or even just a cash account for your toddler, very simply, and put a couple grand in there, because you're gonna spend thousands of dollars on your kids anyway. But if you put a couple grand in there and beat the market like I'm planning on beating it, and we do this annually, obviously, is where it, what it should have been in the first place. $2,000 turns into $4,300,000. $2,000. Start a trading account for your child. Whether they're not born yet, whether they're five or 10 years old, this is super important. That's being a good parent. It doesn't cost you that much. Yes, 15% is above average, but there are plenty of people that do it. Uh, if you don't have time to research stocks, I don't blame you but there are people that do. You can simply buy an ARK Invest ETF. They're focused on growth and disruptive companies. People think that's risky. Well, they're not quite proven. Well, look, the only real risk in the stock market is called shortfall risk. Shortfall risk is just simply not having enough money to retire when it's time to retire. If you're making 5% a year, this goes down to $29,000 over 55 years. You're weighing it down by being afraid to be bold. See the difference in 29,000 and $4.3 million is simply just beating the market. Now you're probably going to the bank because the bank has these professionals and these professionals try to get you into a high fee account where you're paying about two and a half percent, hoping to make five. You're left with two and a half, three, four, five percent on a great year. And they think that's good. Oh, yeah, you're doing great. No one makes money in the stock market. That's a fucking joke, man. Excuse my language. This isn't that hard. Amazon, you know what Amazon's done? It's been around for 23 years. Amazon is compounded at 33% per year over 23 years. That's a percent every 11 days. Your high interest savings account gets you that in over a year. Amazon gets it every 11 days since it's been around. You take 2,000 bucks in Amazon 23 years ago, $1.4 million today. Not every company is gonna grow like this, but you can beat the market. I beat the market. I'm up over 40% this year, more like in five months. My goal is 15% year over year because 15% year over year doubles your money every five years. So what I did, I put $100,000 in. I want that much time. I have approximately 25 years or so till I retire. $3.2 million off my $100,000 investment. If I just try to match the market at eight, 600,000. It's not even close, it's not even comparable. And all these people do is try to get you to be afraid to beat the market. Oh, it's not safe enough, you need to diversify. You don't need to diversify, that's stupid. 
You need a little bit, but a lot is nuts. You don't need to own every shitty company while we're living in a pandemic and the economy is going in the shitter. Now, the economy going in the shitter and the stock market going in the shitter are two different things, but they are related. Now, most of these... Most of these funds are heavily weighted in the big stuff, in the big tech. So while two thirds of the market is absolutely failing, going bankrupt, out of business, the rest is gaining market share. They're weighted heavier in those positions. It makes it look like the stock market is just fine and everything's okay, but it's truly not. A lot of stuff's failing, okay? But just go back to that, $2,000. Your kid is being born. They're supposed to retire when they're 55-ish. 8% gets you 100,000, 137, 15% gets you 4.3 million. It's not even comparable. Now, 15% is my goal. I hope to smoke that. What happens if you beat it by like 1%? Almost another $3 million, $2.5 million, 1% difference. You're going to end up having a, a split with a bunch of bonds, 70% stocks, 30% bonds, because it's safer, it's safer. No, that, that, that just sends you right on a path for shortfall risk. Every percent that you have in bonds, trying to make 1%, oh my God, that could be put in something so much better. Yeah, there's risk in growth companies. Yeah, there's risk all over the market. But if you do your homework, you can pick winners. There's gonna be winners. Companies like Amazon were very clear winners, disrupting, growing, putting every cent back into the company to grow. It's obvious. I've got all every one of the stocks I own, and I right now I own 11. I like to keep it under 10, mainly because I don't like to over diversify. I don't want my 13th best investment taking money that my first and second should be taking because that's just stupid. Um, and that's that's just kind of how I work, but. Look at this. If you beat it by 2% over 55 years, we're now at $11.2 million. Guys, this can be done. ARK Invest, let's just take a look at the ARK K on Yahoo Finance. Okay, let's take a look at the last five years. This is a $16 stock, it's now 93. That is a lot more than 15% a year. This is a diversified fund. This is a very diversified fund of 40 or so holdings. They're all designed to disrupt the competition and do things a new way, generally speaking, technology and digitally driven. But just look at what this has done in five years. It's ridiculous. 6x, roughly. 600% in five years is a lot more than the 8% market average that they tell you is almost impossible to achieve. This is just one company's fund that you can buy. It's a no brainer. I don't own this. And I, here I am saying it's a no brainer. I own a lot of companies in this folder. Um, maybe we'll talk about my portfolio on a different day. But you're doing yourself a disservice by paying fees at your bank. You should be taking control of this yourself. I'll make a video on how to do that. Um, but compound interest is the most important thing I've ever learned about in my life. And you can give your child a great opportunity, a great opportunity here. Just put a couple grand in, even a grand can get them more than enough money to retire off of. So then what do they have to do? They don't have to stress about getting a job with good benefits and a pension and all this stuff uh, and the job they hate, but they do it because they need it. They need something to take care of them later. This opens your kids up to do what they want in life, to have a fun job, to know that when they're 55 years old, they're actually going to be rich, not just getting by. That is the best gift you can ever give your child. So if you don't have time to figure this out, Kathy Wood and the ARK Invest team does. They're not paying me anything. I'm not affiliated. I don't even own those. Just saying a lot of people beat the market, including myself. Okay. I do have a, a private stock group or not just stocks, we do sports betting, everything. Sometimes we go over books and the lessons in them, keep track of ARC, uh, Markets 101. If you're a beginner and you wanna know anything, just simply ask a question there, I'll create some content around it. I mean, I have a full content page of different private videos, this and that, I've got my portfolio in there. 
Uh, it's got about $140,000 in it, so you see all my moves in real time. We talk everything. That's beyond the point. There's a free trial, it's 17 day free trial. It's cheap after that. If you're interested, you can get so much information out of my Slack channel, cancel, don't pay a dime. I'm happy for you. Whatever you wanna do. I don't want anyone paying that doesn't wanna be there, but you can learn this, you can figure this out. Now, remember when I said just by beating it by 1%, that 15 we set could be millions of dollars? Well, ARC just beat the shit out of that. They beat that by like 50%. What happens if you can actually do something crazy like, I don't know, let's say 35% year over year? $29 million, okay? I'm not suggesting that that's possible to achieve 35 a year, but if you're not reaching for it, you're selling yourself very short of a great future. This is absolutely insane, turning 2,000 into 29 million, okay? Not saying it'll be easy, not saying I'm even thinking it's possible, but I do think 15% year over year is very possible. $4 $4 million is quite a nice little nest egg for a $2,000 investment on your kids. Even for yourself, say you're in your 30s, you got 25 years left. It's not a lot at 2000 but it, if you're in your 30s, you're working, you should be able to put money aside for your retirement and get serious about this. So if you have a good whack of money to throw in there, like I did, which isn't a lot for a retirement, but it's something, I mean, gets you into the millions of dollars. That's where I need to be. Everything I own will be paid off by then. I'm slightly diversified with some properties I own too. Everything will be paid off, I'll have very limited bills and suddenly I'll have a million. Still compounding in my account, I'll be able to pay myself hundreds of thousands per year without even making a dent in it with it still growing. Just, you gotta think about that and understand compound interest. Albert Einstein said it's the most fascinating thing he's ever come across in his studies and I totally get it. If you want to start a fund like this for your unborn grandchildren with just a thousand dollars look at what it can be that's how generational wealth is a thing you know where your family just stays rich forever it can be done off a very small investment you have to look into the future are your kids gonna have kids are they gonna have kids if you have an extra thousand bucks around why not give them the opportunity of a freaking lifetime man this is super important stuff. I think it's the most important thing I know that most people just don't seem to comprehend. Compound interest is very important. Beating the market is very important and it's very achievable. Go research some ARK, invest ETFs, hit me up for my Slack channel. There'll be a link in the description. Either place I believe can get you to 15%. There's a lot of people that do it. Guys like uh, Jeremy, financial education are doing it. and. He doesn't even get wild with the you know the crazy growth stocks he he's finding a nice mix of value and growth this is very achievable guys very achievable they don't want you to think it's achievable but it's very achievable you don't need to be that brilliant all the information is available online the balance sheets of the companies everything they do it's all available online you can do this and if you don't have the time like i said arc or maybe even me can take care of you but anyway, that's the video. I, I hope you take something out of this. Uh, let me know in the comments section below if uh, you think this is even possible. Am I reaching too high? Am I not? Whatever. Have a good day, guys.